Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a kind of different video, but the reason behind this and why I've started doing these things in my life is actually because um, living in Australia and then moving to the US um, really opened my eyes to how much like plastic and stuff and just like bad things we do in our everyday life that infect like the environment and everything. And I'm definitely not one of those people that's like super environmentally crazy, like good on those people. But honestly, it's not me. So I'm not trying to like say that I'm like that. But this is just for your average everyday person like myself. Um, just like easy things we can do just to make the world better. Um, so yeah, let's just get on into it. Um, even if you do like one of these things, you can seriously make the biggest difference. Okay, so tip number one is to swap out paper towel for a hand towel. So basically like washing your hands and stuff instead of like grabbing a paper towel every single time, use a hand towel because it's so easy. Like this is, these are literally like the easiest things you can do in your life and honestly like there is no harm in this. It's like in the end going to cost you less because you're going to be buying less paper towel. I'm not saying that you don't have to have paper towel at all but even if yeah you just use it to like dry your hands it seriously is going to make a difference on how much you're using how much you're wasting and yeah okay so tip number two um i actually had kind of heard about these but not that much and i just so happened to be gifted them for my birthday and honestly it was just like the best thing ever because i love them now but basically ditch your makeup wipes for reusable makeup towels um honestly like i've used this so many times you can see how clean it is all i do is chuck it in the wash with my clothes um and it comes out clean all you have to do is put hot water on it so no products at all just hot water and it seriously like it works it takes your makeup off um like i literally just use this and then i cleanse my face and my makeup is gone um I've had these like with me for probably like over six months now. Ooh, I just haven't used makeup wipes for that long because I honestly prefer these and it's water on your skin. Like it's better for your skin. Um, and yeah, this is just like a single use product that you seriously do not need. These are so much better. And honestly, do you even know like what's in these? Like, yeah, enough said. Okay, so number three. This one's getting a little personal, guys, but seriously, this has changed my life. So I'm going to show you guys anyway, but basically ditch your tampons and pads or anything like that for one of these. No, I've never used this. It's a brand new one. Don't stress, guys. But honestly, this is like a menstrual cup. If you don't know what they are, then seriously, you need one in your life. Like, honestly... This is not only good for the environment, but seriously, it's good for yourself. Like, this is a hardcore investment. This is the um, Hello Cup brand, and so far, so good. I've literally been using one of these for like a year now, and it is a serious life changer. You can wear these things for like 12 hours, so it's like twice a day. Like, oh, honestly, it's just like so, so good for the environment, and honestly, it will change your life. Like, it is so much better than these. Just... Trust me, you need one of these in your life. The next thing is these bad boys, plastic bags. Um, yes, I know sometimes we can't all be perfect and it's so hard to remember to like bring your own bags. And I know a lot of places these days, I'm pretty sure at least in the state I live in back in Australia and I think even in Oregon here in the US, um, plastic bags are banned or you can like have to pay for them. Um, so that's really good, but I know we still forget them sometimes. So basically this tip is to obviously try not to use them and use reusable bags. But if you do forget to use them, never just throw them straight out. Make sure they're more than a one-use thing. Um, I literally, like, learned from my parents, like, ever since I was a kid, we always reused our plastic bags. Plastic bags. And, like, um, as, like, trash liners and, like, 
yeah like don't just use them once at least use them twice um so yeah okay so number five is to use reusable um tupperware so don't like use like the cheap like I know it's so much easier if you just buy the, I appreciate they're like two dollars at the store for like a five pack of the plastic takeaway containers. Um, seriously, don't use them. Just buy preferably glass ones or you like the reusable plastic ones as well, but just use reusable ones. Um, and if you do end up with the plastic ones, don't just use them once, reuse them. Um, multiple times before throwing them out because they actually last kind of like long so if you get takeaway um, like from a store like you got like Chinese food eat your Chinese food wash that up and reuse it okay don't just chuck it straight into the trash can next one is reuse um, not reuse use reusable cups and straws and honestly, wow, this paint is still wet. I painted this one myself and I don't know, I feel like that's even more of a motive to use it. It's because like, wow, I just like made this art, you know? Um, so yeah, use reusable cups and stuff. Again, I know it's like really hard to remember, but even if you just did it half the time, it still makes a huge difference. So yeah. Definitely try and implement that one. Tip number seven, guys. I actually was like not sure if I should put this in or not, but it's really something that I want to start doing. So no, I don't actually even do this yet, but I'm going to add it in anyways. Um, use a shampoo and conditioner bar instead of buying them in a bottle. Um, the reason I haven't started doing this yet is actually because I only maximum ever wash my hair twice a week. Um... So even if you reduce how often you're washing your hair and going through the plastic bottles, like that can even make a difference. Plus it's so bad for your hair if you're washing it every day. So double whammy. Um, yeah, but I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. I'll insert a picture here, but basically you can get these shampoo and conditioner bars. And from what I've heard, they're amazing. They last forever. They don't have plastic or anything. So, and seriously, they will take up like half the space in your shower. Like there's just so many benefits. So seriously, get onto that. I need to get onto that. So yeah. Hey guys, just a quick cut in. Um, I didn't want to be that person that was like, you need to do this, but I don't do it. And I was like thinking after I filmed that video, I was like, well, dude, like I need new shampoo. So why don't I buy some new shampoo so i literally it's not gonna freaking focus is it now just bring it up really big i just bought a shampoo bar off iherb so i am following in what i'm talking about i'm following through i just wanted to put that out there okay yeah Okay guys, so that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you're new here, make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and turn on the notification bell. Also guys, make sure to hit up my Instagram right here, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. That was so, such a weird, what am I doing? <laughs>